This will be an unboxing of the OnePlus 7T, as you can see right here. Now I've had this phone or this box for a while now. I just have not gotten around to unboxing the darn thing, but here it is. Now one thing I have to say that this is a long box. I mean, check out how long this is. It's a pretty long box comparison to my Note 10 Plus. So have a look. It's a long box, so I wonder, I'm just a bit curious now what you get in the packaging. So let's go ahead and just make a cut. Now back here, information about the phone. So let's just um, get into it. The OnePlus 7T. Whoops. A little bit of camera shake. My bad. My bad. Throw the plastic to the side. And let me adjust my camera again a little bit. Okay, there we go. All right, here it is. I do love the matte red that OnePlus goes with. Very nice. OnePlus branding right there. So let's uh, get into it. Is there tape? No, no tape. No additional tape. One plus. Here we go. And so what's in here? Okay, what else is in here? A lot of stuff. All right, pamphlets and stuff. Look at how long this is, wow. Never settle and documentation, etc. Put that to the side and then invitation letter. Okay, what is this? Uh, OnePlus embossed right there. Uh, that's a uh, that says open, so let's open it. Woo! And what does this say? Oh, friend. Okay. Pause the video and read that if you want. Put that to the side. And we have some OnePlus stickers here, Never Settle. And this new OnePlus sticker right here on the bottom that you can place on your friend's iPhone 11 Pro Max. Put that to the side. And then more paperwork, put that to the side. And this is the phone itself. So you can see, check out that camera array. That big circle. Very nice. And as you can see, you do have the fingerprint scanner underneath the display of the 7T, which is pretty cool. Go ahead and take this off. Put that to the side, and then we don't need this. So I'm gonna put this away and just place it on the side of the box. And check out this colorway. This matte silver, or matte, not exactly a matte black, like a matte gray. I forgot what the official name was of this color, but looks pretty good. Let's go ahead and turn on this bad chicken. OnePlus powered by Android. Check out the new Android logo. Very nice. Put that to the side. Let's dive in the rest of the packaging. Here you can see Never Settle on the packaging right there. And then Get your warp charge. Yup, warp charge. And then let's see, power supply. Pause the video if you wanna read the specs. You get your USB C to C cable. C to C, right? Nope, it is not. But it's your warp charge, obviously, with the red inside on the cable. Check that out. And then in here, you get your SIM ejector tool, one plus. And then you get a clear case, very nice. I was debating whether I needed the, uh, to buy a case for the OnePlus 7T, but I do not need to any longer since the phone does come with a clear case. Thank you OnePlus, appreciate that, thanks. Put all that to the side and then we'll take a look at the phone. Hi there, let's go ahead and get started. English United States, check out the water drop notch. OnePlus terms and conditions, agree and then agree to that, blah, blah, blah. Uh, no thanks on the experience. No thanks on this. No thanks on that. Sure, agree to that. Connect the mobile network. 
I don't have that right now. I'm just gonna connect to the Wi-Fi. Let's go ahead and, nope, cannot adjust the brightness yet. And then go ahead and type in my password. Obtaining IP address, connecting. This may take a few minutes, checking for updates. Let the phone do its thing, right meow. All right, let it do that. I'm gonna go over the phone real quick. This side of the phone, you have your volume rocker. On the bottom, this is your SIM tray, USB type C, speaker. This side of the phone, power button. This is your alert slider or alert switch. You have a mic up here. I'm gonna flip it over in the back. You have a camera array, three cameras, one plus branding, one plus logo, one plus in this beautiful gunmetal, sil dark silver, matte silver, I guess, colorway. I'm digging this. Very nice, beautiful. All right, let's get back into it. Copy apps and data, don't copy. Just a second, checking the info. Okay, the sign in, we'll skip the sign in stuff for now. Just wanna get into the phone. Just a second. Matter of fact, I'm gonna grab my 7 Pro so we can compare. Let's see, I'm gonna just decline all of this stuff, except, and then face and fingerprint unlock. We're gonna skip this for now, but we're gonna add the fingerprint. So next on that, screen lock, I'm just gonna put a bunch of zeros so you can break into my phone if you want. Next, we enter your pin. Again, bunch of zeros, whatever, confirm. Pins don't match. Confirm again. Did I put too many zeros? Oops. My bad. One, two, three, four. Confirm. Fingerprint setup, so you can see. Right there. Now I'm noticing the fingerprint scanner is pretty low on the screen. So I wonder what OnePlus's reasoning for that is. Maybe up here is a little bit too high for most people. It's pretty low, so you may have to hold your phone kind of awkwardly to get your thumb right in that area, but we'll see. I'm gonna test this out, you know. Yeah, it's pretty low on the display. That's an interesting move. And then edge input. Next, you can get the edges of your thumb. Nice and fast. Fingerprint added. Next, adding finishing touches. And then let's see, Vivid Natural Advance. What's advanced? Check that out. AMOLED Wide Gamut, sRGB. We'll just leave in the advanced for now. Next, actually go back. Vivid. Hmm, actually, advanced looked pretty good. Next. <laughs> and then Roboto or OnePlus Slate font. We'll go with the OnePlus Slate because it's a OnePlus. And then navigation bar and gestures. You have your option here, recents, home and back, or the gestures. We're gonna try out the gestures, why not? Master full screen gesture in three steps. Start, go back, we're gonna go like this, just like the pixel. And then home, we're gonna swipe up from the bottom, just like the pixel again. And then the recent, swipe up and you hold. Well done, very nice. Setup complete. As you can see, phone making noises, which is good. And we are in. All right, so what is this? Allow OnePlus launcher. Sure, I'm gonna allow it. Why not? So here we go. So let's go ahead and I'd like to check a couple of things. Oh, look at this. Update now. Already a software update. Software updates for the win. Love getting updates. But right out of the box, let's go ahead and check out the storage. And then right out of the box, 27 gigs are used. So do the math. That's how much free space you have. Only 21% used. There you go. Go back and then we'll check out the Android about the phone. And then we have Android version 10, obviously. No. Build number a bunch of times. And then, oh, that doesn't do anything. How do you get in the um, developer options? Figure that out later, but here we go. Android 10, you can move this stuff around so you can see. Android Q, here you go. So let me go ahead and grab my 7 Pro real quick. So here it is against the OnePlus 7 Pro on the right. Quick size comparison, so have a look. So it's about the same size actually. 7 Pro, maybe a tad taller side profile. There you go, and then we'll check out the comparison of the display. Then have a look right there. You do have to contend with a notch now on the 7T when you don't have any of that stuff on the 7 Pro.
And let's go ahead and test out the camera real quick. And then we'll click on this and I'll deny this. And then we'll just take a couple photos. Take a photo of this, take a photo of this and something else. And then we'll go the wide angle and then also the 2X zoom so you can see. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and take a quick video as well. I'll go to video right now, and then I'm just gonna take a quick video. This is a quick video of the OnePlus 7T camera. So just a real quick video right now. Let me know if the quality of the audio, etc. Just kind of moving around my unboxing table. Here we go. So let me know in the comments below what you want me to do with the OnePlus 7T is speed tests versus the OnePlus 7 Pro, Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus, iPhone 11 Pro Max, Google Pixel 4 XL. Let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching. Peace out.